Hi and welcome to MeshNet's official channel. This is the tutorial video on how to set up a WooCommerce store to sell gift cards with WooCommerce Gift Card Pro. Let's get started. So first, navigate to the back end. WooCommerce settings, gift card settings. In here, you can allow to apply gift card for shipping fee, for tax, and for WooCommerce fee. You can also allow customer to apply gift card to buy another gift card product. Here is the status of the order to activate and send gift card. We'll set it as completed. In the second tab, you can set the default expiry time for the gift card. If you leave this setting blank, it means that the gift card will never expire. Then you can set the gift card code format. In here, A2 is the short code to generate two characters randomly and N4 is to generate four characters. You can change the numbers and characters as you like. Finally is the default email settings. You can use shortcuts to add the email content and you can allow to attach gift card PDF file to the email. After saving the default settings, now I will show you how to add a PDF template. Click on PDF template, add new PDF template. You can see on the right side, there is a PDF configuration where you can adjust the PDF size, upload the background image. Then you can add text to the design. You are able to change the text font size and color. You can move the text by drag and drop and you can add the available shortcuts. Now we add the short quotes that are available on the right side. You can see here. First is from name, so is the sender, and the receiver. Okay, the messages. It is very convenient when you use the short codes with the drag and drop feature. Okay, now we're done with the short codes. We can also add the QR code. You can click here to add, uh, it is auto generated. You can also change the size of it and I will drag it here. Then we're done. Now we'll see the email templates. Go to email template. We'll see the default templates here. We'll take a look at this one. With the default template, of course, you can freely change the text as you like. You can also change the images. And other than birthday, we also have Christmas, Thanksgiving, and Valentine's templates for your choice. And on the right side, as you can see, there are short codes available for you to add the content. Okay, so now we are going to create a gift card product. Navigate to the product page, add new product. We will create a birthday gift card. Okay, so it's a gift card product type and it's a virtual product. Then you can choose to auto generate or to import the gift card code. I'll show you later how to import the gift card code from backend. About the price, we have three types of pricing. Fixed price, selected price, and custom price. Let's try with the selected price. The selected price will display as a drop down list. So we have to insert the price options. For example, here I will insert three options. You can set the expiry date for the gift card by date from date picker or by number of days from the buying time. If you leave this field blank, the gift card will never expire. Then you can choose the email template and the PDF template. Next is excluding the product. This is our new feature that allows you to exclude one or more products from the coupon application list. In here, I'll try with one product. 
Then you can name the PDF file that is attached to the gift card email. I will upload an image for this product and we're done. So we just created a gift card product. Now I will show you how to import gift card. You can download the sample file here. Click on here to upload the codes. The file format is CSV. Now I will upload the gift card file. In step 2, we will map the gift card value. This is an easy step. You just have to match the gift card code and the balance. In the product configuration, just fill in the product you are uploading the gift card codes for. Then you can import it to the database. You can see in the report if there's any code that is duplicated. You can see the uploaded gift card codes in the gift card. So that's the end of the tutorial video. In the next video, we'll show you how customer can buy a gift card on WooCommerce Store. Thank you for watching.